things are definitely on the mend with Toby. You know, we made it past that awkward post-fight stage, and we're tighter than ever. We're doing all kinds of stuff together. You got this. Focus up. Give him one. Give him two. Yeah. Three. Fake. Oh! oh! He's doing we came up with a sick new handshake, version five. This is probably the one. I bet this is yes. the one. Up, up, up. Oh, right. Do the spin. Spin again. Yeah. All right, dude. That was it. We've even tried some trust exercises. You know, I, I used to do this with my brother. He would always drop me. Oh my gosh, I'm not gonna drop you, okay? Let's have you empty your pockets just to be safe. Yeah, good call. So did you text her yet? No, I don't know what to say. Let's just do this. Right. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, one, two, three, trust fall. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I trust you more than my brother now. Yeah, brothers are tools. Mine used to lock me in the community pickle barrel. Dude, how old are you? People still use barrels. Not for community pickle storage. You know what? This is why I don't tell you anything, man. Okay? Whatever. Let's just do this. Yeah, go. I'm ready. Three. Two. One. Dude, I'm so sorry. I thought it was Emily texting me. Are you kidding me? You're, also, you're kind of invisible, so I mean, it's hard for me to know when you were going to fall. I did a countdown! Yeah. So Nick's finally decided to get his first tattoo. He's all grown up. He's been wanting one for a long time, and he actually said that I uh, kind of inspired him. So, <laughs> I'm pretty excited to see it. Toby! Toe! Toblerone! Nick! Nick! <laughs> Teen! Patch! I don't know, we'll workshop it. Let me see your ah! Oh, oh. Okay, gosh, it hurt. What happened? Oh. I was just... Falling down the stairs, and I remember you telling me I could go through the stairs. So I just went through it, landed on this. Do you have any idea how expensive this is? What are you talking about? It looks like a clearance item from a home goods store. No, no, nothing in this house was bought on clearance, man, I guarantee. Uh, just help me up, okay? Uh, oh. What are we gonna do? Hey, what are you doing? Wait, wait. Your tattoo's just words? Forget about the tattoo, man! Look at this! The Livingstons are particular. Um, they do a walkthrough of their entire house every time they come to visit, so they're gonna notice if this isn't replaced. Plus, Toby told me that the last guy got fired for stealing. So I really can't fuck this up. Oh, yeah, no. See, I told Nick that I got a previous house sitter fired by framing him for stealing. It's probably better he remembers it this way. Oh man, we're in luck! I found it! It's the statue Vidi Descends. It's super rare. There's only like 10 duplicates. Okay, so is anyone selling one? Yeah! Oh, some dude in Salt Spring Island, British Columbia. That's great! Let's buy it! Oh. Uh... Neighbors to the north, my ass. You wouldn't happen to have a whole bunch of money saved somewhere, would you? Yeah, no, I uh, I lost all my money in the Ponzi scheme. Fifteen ninety nine for shipping. Who is this joker? I gotta go for a walk, dude. Shit. Yeah, that bad investment almost ruined me. But what really made me hit rock bottom was gambling. I played some pretty high stakes back in my day. Deeds to houses, illegal furs, cruise line tickets. Although losing that last one actually saved my life. Anyway, a couple years ago, I found online gambling. And I was back in it. Hard. It's even led to some invitations to some backroom tables in real life, which, obviously, I couldn't attend. 
But maybe it's time to uh, see how solid those connections really are. Nick? What? What are you doing? I got it, dude. We can sell Cheetos. This is how we're gonna make our money. What? Seriously, the Harambe Cheeto sold for $99,900. The Jesus Cheeto sold for $99,900. All we need to do is find our big money Cheeto. And we're set. Have you been up all night? Yeah. These are the winners so far. All I need to do is find a George Harrison and we've got a complete Beatles set. <laughs> um... Yeah, no, this is a really good idea, man. I just think that maybe I found something that'll yield us more money in less time. Seriously? Yeah, but you gotta trust me, okay? More than Cheetos? More than Cheetos. It's more than my brother. So you're gonna possess me and play a high stakes card game with your online poker buddies. Well, don't romanticize it, but yeah. I don't know, man. This seems pretty risky. Hey, we got this, all right? I picked these chumps for a reason. We can win. Now just relax and don't fight me. Just let me take the wheel, okay? Yeah. So you want me to... Showtime. We are Mr. Fox. Then there's Miss Raven. Mr. Wolf. Mr. and Mrs. Swan. Mr. Mongoose. And finally, Mr. Grizzly. Camera. These aren't going to be in game, no? No, no. They are merely here to film your arrival so that we can give you something to, to watch later on your way out. It's a uh, keepsake. What the hell is that accent? I don't know. It helps to cover whatever this is. Dude, this is such a bad idea. How do we not think about the cameras? You have got to stay out of that room and out of sight, okay? It looks like there's a straight on the board. Where are you from? Noral. Mr. Fox acts too quickly. 
Take it to him. What the hell happened in there, man? We were supposed to win. I know. He's a lot better in person than he is online. Well, we're f I mean... I know. I'm sorry. I... How much did we spend just to make this happen? Um, excuse me. Mr. Uh, Grizzly would like to speak with you. Ah, Mr. Fox. You put on a pretty good card game. You are a good player. <laughs> well, say, uh, this uh, collection, is it of Beatles? We? Oui. Mm. Well, uh, how much? Well, uh, the Harambe and the Jesus Chito sold for 99,900 $99, each. <laughs> Hello, George. Look, man, you had to text her sometime. You know what? I'm back to trusting my brother more than you. <sighs> I can live with that. <sighs> 